In this tutorial, we're going to review how to create a great looking resume in Microsoft Word. The very first thing you're going to do is uh, open up a new document and the way you're going to do it is by going to File and then going to New. I'm doing this in Microsoft Word 2013. If yours looks different, uh, the basic principles behind this and the other versions are the same. You're just going to have a little bit different look and feel, but you're still going to be able to create a great looking resume uh, no matter what version you have. So under the new section, you'll see there's quite a few different items to choose from. Uh, on the template side, uh, we could create a blank document and do this from scratch, but there's really not a reason uh, that you need to do that because Microsoft's already uh, done a fab fabulous job of creating a full list of templates to choose from. So that's what we're going to do. And the first thing we're going to do is come up to suggested search searches and click on resume. And that's going to search through all of Microsoft's templates online and then pull up the ones that best fit, uh, best fit the template search. And here you go. You have a full list of templates to choose from. You can see that it uh, doesn't show exactly how... Oh, never mind. Here it shows up here. There are 36 different ones you can choose from. You can go with ones that are a little bit more plain and black and white. You can have some that have a little bit of color, and you can have some that have a lot of different uh, style options and are very unique. We're going to go with one that's kind of in between, and uh, but it offers a really professional look and feel. So we're going to come with this one right here. Brings it up in a preview window. And if for any reason uh, you don't like the way it looks in here, it's very easy to just click the X button and go back. But we're going to click Create. And here you go. It automatically preloads your name into it as long as you're working on your computer. And then it's very easy to use, uh, enter your street address and city, state, telephone, website, and email. It plugs all of those right into the system and then you can go start editing. Uh, you can, in this particular template you can create uh, what your objective is with the resume then some of your professional achievements this is where you can put certifications and different things like that your list of skills your work history education and all your references so this is a really nice easy way to create a resume we'll take a look at one more click new click on resume again and you have a full list. We're going to go with the black and white one this time with a totally different kind of look and feel. This one's a little bit more unique and uh, it's definitely something that may catch a, uh, a recruiter's eye because there aren't a lot of resumes that look like this one. If you're doing something for a uh, say a design job or something like that, being able to create a unique resume is something that can possibly give you a, uh, a head start against other candidates. So right here it's the same thing. It preloads your first and last name. It put you. This is where you can put the your current job title or possibly the job title you're applying for. And then it has the same sections. You can click here and select the objective. Then you can do your experience, positions held, education, degrees if you have one, uh, all your references, and then all your contact information right here. But as you can see, Microsoft Word does a great job of being able to make it very easy to create a resume literally within minutes. So great job. You know, now know how to create a resume using Microsoft Word.